Well, almost two dozen books are being pulled from Marietta City Schools Reading Center. The decision came down just a few hours ago. Fox News Denise Dillon is live in Marietta, and Denise, not everyone agreed with this decision. Yeah, of course, there were parents with very strong opinions on both sides of the issue. The superintendent said there are about 20,000 books in the Reading Center, and he said these 23 books needed to be removed. I was surprised by what was in our Reading Center. Marietta City Schools Superintendent Dr. Grant Rivera says countless hours were spent determining which books were not appropriate for students. He says it was a challenging process. The academic content and historical value were taken into consideration. And in the end, he said, 23 books needed to go due to their sexual or inappropriate content. 20,000 books that we had, in particular, this list I bring you this evening is 23, where I have no hesitation whatsoever. Earlier this year, the district removed two books, Flamer and Me and Earl and the Dying Girl. The new list of 23 includes a book by author J.K. Rowling, known for her Harry Potter series, and a series of books by author Sarah J. Moss. Some agreed with removing the books. Well, I think we need to be careful about what our children are reading. I'm so thankful that the school board has done this. Um, I am, there should be a set standard of what books we have in our library. Others call it censorship and say it's just not right. Marietta High School junior Bella Gant says her favorite book is on the list. We're teenagers and we're about to go to college and they're preparing us to be the future and we need to be ready for, to face the reality that we are going to see and be able to develop as not just students but humans. I'm sad for the students. Obviously the students are losing a lot of books that they love and care about. The final vote tonight, six to one. Anyone can appeal the decision. Reporting live in Marietta, Denise Dillon, Fox 5 News.